Hallelujah. So remember, it's not just to know about the season, it's to understand and apply yourself about the event of that season. That was, that was what made the children of Issachar, the 200 of them, better than the rest. So also, you know, the scripture says in John chapter 1, if you read from verse 1 to 3, and I think I'm going to read it. It says, in the beginning, the word already existed. The word was with God. And the word was God. He already, he was already with God in the beginning. Everything came into existence through him. Not one thing that exists was made without him. Now, that is a privileged revelation. I don't want to use the word information so that it will not be you know, reduce as it is. That's a privileged revelation. And that's why you find out that, that everything that you talk about or that people are talking about, there is always an import. Most of the things that happen around us, changes that happen start by the world. Now, if you know, if you don't have understanding of beginning of a discussion and you just come into it, there's a tendency that you, you choose wrong or you take a wrong decision, or you will be, you know, you be guilty of what you should not be guilty of because you are not there at the beginning of the discussion. The, if you don't have understanding of where somebody is coming from, and you just start advising this person or talking to the person, you can run foul. And that's why the Bible says in John chapter 8 and 32, John 8, 32, he said, it is when you know the truth that you set to, that you, this truth will set you free. The truth you don't know will put you in bondage. Ignorance is not an excuse in law. No matter, oh, I did not know, you did not know, but you have committed the crime. So, in every of the season of your life, have the understanding that you have to know what, how it started. You have to understand the beginning. If the foundation of a house is not well done, the house will always suffer. Sir, try hard to know the truth about everything before you go into it. It will give you victory. The Lord bless you.